All right. Um, ignore the black and white cop stuff. We're doing a quick build. We're going Hound Doom Clef Starmy. Cloisterless stuff. Uh, we want either Zap or Coo. Probably Coo. Probably Coo. Raikou. Something good to fade. Like maybe Skarm. That's tempting. Skarm Hound Doom. No, then if you won't click, if you click Skarm, then you just should have a uh, Tyranitar instead of Hound Doom here. Basically, the idea behind Hound Doom and Clef is Hound Doom removes the ghost so that Clef can do crazy stuff. And the rest of the team tries to support that. This could be actually Curse Rest. Like, this could be Rest Talk too. So we have a double normal spam. I don't love that. Um, we want something that can do something to Skarmory. Because Skarmory, so far, really pisses this team off. So what's a decent lure for Skar Skarmory? Not Lurie, but like something that does well into it. That also is normal in phaser. Hint, hint. We can go uh, ride on our Steelix here. So examining the differences, uh, Rhydon is a horrible electric check, but is much more offensive. Steelix, and it does take advantage of paralysis support on electrics. Um, Steelix can spread the para itself by dragon breathing everything in sight. And can boom on Skarmory. Hmm. I think we go ride on. Because Houndoom and Ride On do have uh, decent synergy. Because Houndoom mercs Jinx and Egg, which really uh, prevent Ride On from doing stuff. So lefties, Rock Slide, Rock Slide, EQ, uh, Curse, Rule War, because we need a phaser. Starmy very well could be. Um, Thunder Wave here, but I like Thunder for just murdering uh, Cloister. Actually, do we want to look at the calc for that? Here's a nifty tip if you're using Pokemon Showdown. You can uh, click on your name, click chat self, type slash calc. There you go. Magic. Isn't that lovely? Uh, go to GSC. Starmy versus Cloister Thunder. Okay. So you do you Surf Thunder it or do you Elko it after Spikes? Lovely stuff. Thunder HP water because we remove eggy rest sleep talk leftovers check 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 now we play a game mm. can it, I think it can be rest talk lax that would be nice It could also be fire, for be flamethrower lax. Okay, let's try let's try flamethrower. Yeah. Okay. Quick build, quick build, quick build. Clef how do quick build. Clef Houndoom, me, Dawn. That's not what you want to see if you're using this team. You do not want to see a Nidoking. 
Especially when the clicks thief turn one because that's really bad. Now we have a really hard time absorbing sleep. Go to lax. Now I got a coup. Why would you thunder there? I don't understand. Yeah, I'm just gonna go rest talk lax here. Thunder away. That's a really, really nice crit. Except like, I can kind of just go star me and have fun. Still, Needle King is really scary. Uh, it's Thunder. So, is it Thunder? Is it, like, not Lovely Kiss? I think it's not Lovely Kiss, so I can go uh, lack safely into it. Because you really need Ice Beam, otherwise Zapdos just murders you. And even though we're not using Zapdos on this team, Zapdos... There's an argument for it being on almost every single team. This, this is some bizarre stuff. Like, how, like if you want to make a better version of this team, replace Houndoom with Snorlax, not Snorlax, Houndoom with Tyranitar, and Rhydon with Skarmory, and you're instantly in a much better place. Maybe even Toxic Lax. Hmm, but we want to use Clef Houndoom, because interesting synergy. Houndoom just feels like a non-mon so much of the time, though. Like, it just doesn't do anything until it does something. You know? It sees a it sees a trappable target, and then it goes berserk into the Starmie. But, it doesn't, then you run into a bunch of teams that, um... You run into a bunch of teams that just use a bunch of Nido King. Uh, like Nido Zap, EQ Lax, without Gengar, Nido Tar stuff. You run into a bunch of Nido Tar stuff, and you just get really, really sad. Tar is actually kind of a problem, isn't it, for this team? Holy cow! Hold on, Tar is a ma. What does this team do against Tyranitar? I mean, Rhydon is nice, but this team has a severe Surf Tyranitar weakness. Maybe that is a pretty strong case for EQ on Lax. But yeah, uh, this this team does not like absorbing uh, Lovely Kiss from Needle King. Hmm. Though Sharmi is not bad against Nino King. But yeah, it's kinda weak to Nino King. Without Rest Talk Lax. We'll try one more game. Oh wait, we're using my actual account, are we? Aren't we? Oh well, that's It's fine, I can take the Elo loss. Wait, 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 wait. Was that Gen 4 OU? Yeah. Hmm. I'll join GSCOU. This is a team I've been messing around with for quite a bit. Please be cloak and dagger. Dang it. Uh, you... In this team, you body slam Cloyster. You body slam it twice. Now you go to me. Take the toxic and now you thunder this thing. And you hope that doesn't happen. Now you spin. Now you got a coup. Hmm. You really don't want Starmie to be toxic. Alright, please don't be a demon set. That does a lot. That does a lot. Rock slide here. Does a chunk. Curse, I curse. I think I think it just has to be sleep talk. No, because sleep talk body slam doesn't do anything into opposing lax. It really doesn't. You really need double edge for the power, but like stuff like this can just happen. Yeah, now you gotta run because I kill you. So switch to your Zapdos and die. 
I think we just have to go sleep talk double edge. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! That's a feels good moment. Just rock slide again. Okay, he... It's fine. Because now we go to Star Me and click Surf. Okay. Zapdos gone. That's quite nice. Cloyster, I thunder you. Die. Eggy. Oh, Houndoom. Houndoom, Houndoom, Houndoom. Uh, first we go to Raikou, though, because I... Now we pivot to Houndoom. You know, that's probably the most that Houndoom could have done. Okay, I think we go to Lax now. Meet his Lax. Curse. And then we switch into Clefable. Now we go to Clef. Click Encore. He's stuck for three to six turns. Honestly, I think we Belly Drum. We're doing a decent bit of damage, and he's stuck in Encore for quite a bit. I think it's a roll to kill here. Lovely stuff. Clefable. Lovely stuff. Either way, he dies to recoil there. Heracross, that's quite scary. Lovely stuff. Clefable. That's a nice Clefable endgame for you. And that's what we call this quick build.